questions. Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. Anyway, are you a high value <laughs> man or not? Yes, yes or no? Listen, you know, ladies. Do you meet president. the criteria of a high value man as per that Samuel's you man? Guys can, on you guys YouTube. can assume. You guys can assume what you like. Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. Anyway, are you a high value <laughs> man or not? Yes, yes or no? Listen, you know, ladies. Do you meet president. the criteria of a high value man as per that Samuel's you man? You guys can on you guys YouTube. can assume you guys can assume what you like. What's up guys? John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Today we're gonna look at a hilarious clip from Myron Gaines of Fresh and Fit, basically dodging the question of whether or not he's a high value man, which is highly suspect and also hilarious, okay? If you are new to my critique and analysis of these fucking idiots, the duo known as Fresh and Fit, okay? I've gone on extensively in other videos how they are pseudo alpha, how they are fake fucking gurus, how they are just massive scammers and not real experts, okay? And it, it, these other videos are hilarious. We'll put the links in the description. I'll put the thumbnails up around here. Basically, we exposed Myron for paying girls not, not only to have sex, but also to bring on the show as a guest. We exposed Walter and Myron as having no fucking qualifications as real dating experts. Okay, Walter Weeks was working for a website builder called Wix about six months ago. Okay. And it's just hilarious, these guys. Uh, and let's be clear, everyone in the, in the comments, every fucking day in the other videos, oh, you're a hater, you're so jealous of their growth. Uh, no, they're in the fucking dating space, and they're claiming to have the number one dating podcast on the internet, but these guys are fucking tools that are just running around pretending to be good with girls, and they don't know what the fuck they're talking about, okay? So uh, we're going to uh, run through this clip here. It's a short clip, but I don't want you guys to see what I'm talking about here. Uh, before we continue... If you would like to master the whole game and get very good, very, very fast, jump on a free 30-minute call, and we will go through exactly how we can get you from wherever you're at to a very advanced level in the game very quickly. Okay, My channel provides straightforward, no-bullshit, practical dating advice. I believe, by far, the best dating advice on the internet because it's extremely systematic and works extremely well. Most guys that go through my week program end up closing one to two new girls a week, going on track to do 50 to 100 girls a year. And also putting about one new rotation girl on per week, one new regular for their harem. Okay, so please subscribe below if you have not already. Jump on that free 30 minute call. Okay, here we go. I'm telling you that if you're involved in sex work, your propensity to be able to lock down a high value guy of some kind of real consequence in a relationship is going to diminish significantly. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Men are repulsed by women that are in sex work and/or overtly promiscuous. But you also are a high-value man who just said he's dated multiple OnlyFans strippers. I never da, referred da, da, da. to myself as a high-value man, but okay. I never referred to myself as a high-value man, but okay. I never referred to myself as a high-value man, but okay. But let, let's dig deeper here. You don't but consider I, but I, but yourself I, that? Yeah, you know, I don't want to be cocky, but I have dated multiple women that work in that industry, I and I. <laughs> so the girl is like putting on a pointed question: Do you consider yourself a high-value man? Well, you know what? I don't want to be cocky. But you have the right to answer yes or no to these yeah, questions. Yeah, are you a high value man? Questions. Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. And look how look how he's like. Look at his face, because he knows deep down he's like an ultra beta male. Okay, this dude stages these fucking pseudo alpha fake kickouts. Any real alpha dude, okay, that that's been in the game, that's that's tore up the game really hard, that's fucking dated lots of beautiful women around the world. Okay, for those of you that aren't familiar with myself, at the time of this recording, I've slept with over 1,378 girls in 30 different countries all around the world. Okay, I've been coaching this for over a decade. That's why I call out fucking little punks like this. Watch, watch the wavering in his eyes. Watch how weak he is and watch how internally he knows he's not high value whatsoever. Okay, and he, watch his face here. High value man? Are you a high value man? This is fucking gold. Look, look at his face. High value questions. man? Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. Anyway. Are you a high value <laughs> so man or not? Yes, yes or no? Listen, you know, ladies. Do you president. meet the criteria of a high value man as per that Samuel's you man guys can, on you guys can assume. You guys can assume what you like. Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. Anyway. Are you a high value <laughs> man or not? Yes, yes or no? Listen, you know, ladies. Do you meet the criteria of a high value man as per that Samuel's you man? Guys can, on you guys YouTube. can assume. You guys can assume what you like. <laughs> the, 
Is that not a fucking queer ass response? I've ever seen one. You guys can assume what you like. The point <laughs> I'm Why trying can't to make you is, answer it? I'm, I think deflection is very yeah. telling. Okay, well, you guys can assume. So what he's you want. a wannabe high value man? There you go, wannabe. <laughs> there you go, wannabe high value man. Pseudo alpha. Let's, let's pop up that thumbnail. That says it all, okay? Let's watch this clip one more time because it's fucking sad as fuck uh, without any interruptions. I'm telling you that if you're involved in sex work, your propensity to be able to lock down a high value guy of some kind of real consequence in a relationship is going to diminish significantly. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Men are repulsed by women that are in sex work and are overtly also promiscuous. also are a high value man who just said he's dated multiple OnlyFans strippers. I never da, referred da, da, da. to myself as a high value man, but okay. You don't but consider I, but I, but yourself I, but I, that? <laughs> Yeah, you know, I don't want to be cocky, but I have dated multiple women that work in that industry. I and feel I'm, like you have the right to answer yes or no to these yeah, questions. Yeah, are you a high value man? Questions. Are you a high value man? That'd be very cocky. Anyway. Are you a high value <laughs> man or not? <laughs> yes or no? Listen, you know, ladies. Do you meet the criteria of... <laughs> Fresh is like, ladies, uh, please. A high value man as per that Samuel's you man guys can, you on guys can assume. You guys can assume what you like. The point I'm Why trying can't to make you is, answer it? I'm, I think deflection is very yeah. telling. Okay, well, you guys can assume. So he's a wannabe high value man? There you go, wannabe. <laughs> there you go, wannabe. Kaboom. That's what I've been saying in all these other fucking videos. Does, does it matter that they're growing rapidly on YouTube? Fuck no. Does it matter that, that their podcast is entertaining? Fuck no. Okay. Hot chicks are not going to want to fuck this dude for free. Okay, that's a fact. Okay. And, and it's even been revealed that he's having to go and pay them. And he's offering to fucking pay them to come on the show as well. And then I'm going to reveal in a different video. This was just passed along to me as well. And by the way, whoever has any more funny clips like this for, that are commentary worthy, please send them to John at JohnAnthonyLifestyle.com. Uh, but there's another clip coming soon where he's basically trying to extort a girl for sex to come on the, the podcast. All right. So we'll, we'll take a look at that. Uh, but yeah, fun as always. Fucking railing on these dumb fucks. I recently made a video about how they went on the No Jumper podcast and were trying to say that my Lacon claim is fake, okay, about the fact that I'm coming up on 1,400 girls. Oh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. No Jumper says that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard, okay? Good thing I have massive support for it. We'll put up the thumbnail at the bottom. I have a video about having proof for over 1,000 girls, okay? More proof in the industry than anyone by far. And we're going to put up info cards. We're gonna, I'm going to start adding those as we go through. So the, all those videos that I referenced throughout the video, they're going to have info card links behind them. So you can click and go see those other videos, but also put the links in the description. So thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe below. Press the notification bell for new videos every single day. Also, if you want to be trained by a real expert on a real optimized system and get extremely good at the game very fast, okay, from someone that can admit that he's a high value man comfortably. What the fuck was that? Oh, you're not saying anything. I don't you know. I'm not going to say that. What is he trying to fucking is he is he trying to do like reverse psychology on the girls? So if I say I'm high value, then I must not be high value. So I'm going to play this little game where I'm just going to not say anything. And the girls are like, oh, you're just basically impersonating a high value alpha. And he's like, yeah, that's a wannabe, which is exactly what he is, which is fucking hilarious. He, he, his little like tactics to deflect and like, you know, give the right answer ends up giving the right answer. So this has been fun as always. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and, and jump on that call. Please like, comment, and share. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care. Some do it for the income, but we do it for the outcome. Some of us are active while others just let their mouth run. No doubt, son, this is not just about fun. We will not be outdone by these cowards who shout scum.